Alright then guys, so we're back now playing some more FIFA 18 and as you can see of course we are away from home in our first game in this episode. We're coming up against Swindon Town. Uh, now Swindon Town in the league are in the place above us. I believe we are in 5th place, Swindon Town are in 4th. This is a very much a big clash in the EFL League 2. We've just ticked over into January 2018 as well. I'm not too sure if we're going to be buying any players in the January transfer window, but this is an all-important game for us. You know, we haven't really had the best of it at the end of last episode, so hopefully we can kick off this one with a win. Let's get straight into it. Alright then, guys. So now we are getting things underway here at Swindon Town. Like I said at the start, hopefully we can win this. It'll be a massive win if we can. Let's get straight down to business. Oh, there's no one there at the back post. I should have just hit that with Marsh Brown. You know, he was by far our best player in one of our last games. Look at that. Away records. We are the best. We are we are the best in EFL League 2 away from home, which is phenomenal for us. No. That's easy, Collins. Collins, no. What are you doing? Don't punch that. Grab it. Oh my god, how have you let him get that? No, no, no. Collins, come on. No, don't let him don't let him get inside. Oh my word, good save, Collins. One for the cameras for sure. But a good save nonetheless. Oh my god, and Bennett just can't control it. No, 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 no. Oh my word. What is going on with our passing, seriously? Get away with it that time. You see that? You see that? There you go. Come on, Randall. That's yours all the way. Oh, Good tackle there from their right back, I believe. Oh my word, how is it? How, how? No, no, get it away. Oh, come on! Oh, just before half time, that would have been fantastic. I genuinely thought the referee was going to blow up there. Oh, that would have been absolutely fantastic if we could have scored just on the stroke of half time. We've got an opportunity now to make it 1-0 just before half-time with this corner. Ooh, come on. Oh my word, what kind of shot was that? There we go. End of the first half, it remains 0-0. Marsh Brown can still keep it in, come on. Come on, chase it, chase it down, use the pace. He's still got it, he's got it, he's got it. You're away, you're away, who's there? Oh, just... Just got a bit crowded out there in the box. This is some good play now. There we go, you're through! Oh, Brown was almost through there. No! Oh my word! We are so lucky. Back out off of the crossbar. They're from Swindon Town. We're on a counter attack now of our own. Come on. Oh, we, we just run into players. All of the time we go forward, we just run into our players. But look, now we get we come forward and no one's there to help us in our counter attack. We're all too slow. Look, who's running in that space? Come on, Randall. We see all of that. You see all of that. Far post. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky, lads. Come on. Ten minutes left. We are really throwing everything and the kitchen sink at this Swindon side, but it remains nil-nil in the dying moments of this game. Come on. Show him outside. Don't let him make that cross in. Get it away. No, that that that's not what that's not what away means. There we go. Look, come on man, we're meant to be trying to bomb people forward now. Oh, Randall unlucky, come on. Come on, he's through, he's through! Last moment! Oh my word, what a goal that is! Just as we enter injury time! 1-0! What a goal that is! 90th minute, absolutely amazing there from Christian Doidge. Our main man at the front alongside Luke James. What a pass that was into his feet as well. Their defensive line was just static there. All ha all of them had their arms raised. Trying to claim offside, but it wasn't offside. And he's as cool as you like. He slots it past the keeper. There's nothing you can do about that. Come on. Now, just don't concede. That's all we've got to do is just play it nicely around the back. That's it. Just keep possession. There we go. Come on. Brilliant away win 
against Swindon Town in the EFL League 2. It does take us above them in the League 2 table. Absolutely fantastic. All right, then, guys, so here is our Youth Academy Youth Squad update. Uh, at the start of February, we did sim forward through January. I'll bring you a quick update on that in just a second, but we can see Fabio Ribeiro, that goalkeeper, 64. We have been working on him, and, of course, his potential is 81 to 94, so he's still going to be up there as one of the future best goalkeepers in the world. Carlos Lins has been going along steadily as well, overall 59. He's still got potential 81 to 91. And we've got little old Alex Consentiel, of overall of 50, 76 to 82 potential, so a potential backup to Fabio Ribeiro in the future. But without further ado, guys, I'm going to go ahead and show you the games that we simmed in January. Okay then, guys, so obviously we kicked off today's episode with a 1-0 away win against Swindon Town, which was just absolutely fantastic. The 90th minute winner there from Christian Deutsch. We then came up against Cambridge United at home, managed to scrape a draw. We know that we're not really that great at home, so a draw is absolutely fantastic for us in my mind. We then came up against Carlisle United away from home, a draw 2-2. What a thriller that was, uh, four goals in all. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't come away with the win, but it's still a point away from home, so I can't really complain. And then the final game that we did play on the 30th of January in 2018 was a home game against Port Vale, and we managed to come away with that one. For we managed to come away from that game with yet another draw, so another draw at home, another point at home. However, it was a bit disappointing considering Port Vale did go down to 10 men quite early on, so we weren't able to capitalise. But the next game that we're going to be playing in February comes up against Coventry City at home so hopefully we'll be able to grab all three points in this game. Alright then guys let's go uh, we're playing at home of course against Coventry City big clash in League 2 hopefully like I said we can come away with all three points on this game but let's get straight down to it. Good defending there Oh look again why are you running away from the ball when it's coming towards you? Don't wait for it to come towards you. Go towards the ball. Oh my word. What is that pass? Honestly, our passing is just poor. What? That went... That went in? From, from the angle of the camera, Collins looked as if he was just watching that just go over his bar. Look at this! Oh my word! Holy cow! What a hit that is! Look, Collins just watched it. I was convinced that was going over. Come on, come on, come on! There we go! Anything you can do, I can do better. An instant response there. Let's go. What a goal that was. Luke James with the equaliser. Only moments after Coventry have scored an absolute weldy. Luke James pops up out of nowhere. Fantastic ball played through to him. Manages to get past the defender and just poke it over the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper came rushing out. We can watch it again now. Look at this brilliant pass there from Deutsch. Manages to outmuscle and outpace his defender. And he just sort of... Plays a little deft chipped shot over to the left hand side. The goalkeeper tries to dive and save it. Unfortunately he gets there just a bit too late. And the ball sails past him and into the back of the net. 1-1. One, one. Oh you see that? James is through again. James is through. James is through. Out muscle him. Ooh. He hit that with some ferocity. But the goalkeeper O'Brien managed to get down smartly to his right hand side. Almost 2-1 and James's second goal, but for the likes of O'Brien between the sticks for Coventry. You see that? You see that space? Run into it. Come on, James. Come on, James. Come on. Cut back. Who's there? Who's there running in? Oh, it was Marsh Brown, I believe, in the centre there. Goalkeeper, yet again with a fantastic save. You see that ball? You see that ball? Oh, ref! Ref! Surely that's a pen! How is that not a pen? He's been pushed over as he went to take the shot and he stumbled. How is that not a penalty? What was that? Oh, I, I, I'm honestly not even going to, like, 
I'm not going. I'm not. I'm not surprised anymore. I am seriously just not surprised with the amount of passes that we just can't make forward. You know, we just look for someone, and then we always end up finding our opposition players, and it's just, it's just poor at the moment. Five minutes left to go. Come on, James. You see that? You see that? Who? Who? Look, oh my! You just stopped running. You stopped running. What is going on? Like you just. You had so much space in front of you and then you just stopped. Oh my word. And then we just get dispossessed. Because they get so many players behind the ball and there's nothing we can do. No. No. No, not like this. 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 Honestly, heart in the mouth right there. There we go. Final score 1-1. Yet again, another draw at home. Alright then guys, so that's it for today's episode of my playthrough of FIFA 18 as Forest Green Rovers. Uh, unfortunately, we weren't able to win in that last game. But, you know, we managed to pick up a win in the dying moments against Swindon Town, so that's always good. If you did enjoy the video, please be sure to smash that like button. And if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. As you can see, next time when we come back, we've got Newport um, away from home in our next game so hopefully we can grab all three points from that one as well but for now i will see you in the next episode